Some people with breathing problems need to inhale medicine into their lungs. Inhaled medicines can be delivered by a device called a nebulizer or by a variety of devices called inhalers. This video will show you how to use a dry powder inhaler called the Mometazone Twisthaler. Mometazone is also known as Asmonex. Mometazone helps reduce symptoms of asthma by decreasing inflammation and swelling in your airways. It's important to use the inhaler exactly as prescribed, even when you feel fine. This will help you breathe easier in the long run. The Mometazone twist inhaler is not a rescue inhaler. Rescue inhalers give relief right away to someone who's having a severe asthma attack. Your doctor or pharmacist can tell you more about rescue inhalers if you need one. When you get your Mometazone twist inhaler, check the expiration date on the box to make sure it's still good. The inhaler comes in a foil package. Tear it open to remove the inhaler. Once the foil is opened, the medicine is good for 45 days. Check your calendar. Count 45 days from today. And write that date on the twist haler cap with a permanent marker. The twist haler cap is important because it keeps out dirt and moisture. It also loads each dose for use. To use the twist haler, twist the cap to the left until you hear a click. The click tells you that a couple of important things have happened. First, it means a dose of medicine is loaded and ready to use. Second, it means the dose counter on the side of the twist haler has gone down by one. When the counter reaches double zero, there are no doses left and the cap will automatically lock. Make sure you get a refill when the dose counter gets below 20. After loading the medicine, Breathe out fully, away from the inhaler. Put the mouthpiece in your mouth and close your lips around it. Don't cover the air holes with your lips. Breathe in quickly and deeply and try to hold your breath for 10 seconds. Then relax and breathe out normally. The medicine is a very fine powder. You won't feel, taste, or smell it. If you're supposed to take two doses, Repeat these steps again. After taking the medicine, rinse your mouth with water. This reduces the chance of side effects, such as infections in the mouth and throat. Keep your twist haler clean and dry at all times. If you need to wipe off the mouthpiece, you should do it before you put the cap back on. That's because taking the cap off loads another dose of medicine, and you don't want to do that. Gently wipe the mouthpiece using a dry cloth or a tissue. Water or even a damp cloth could ruin the medicine. Now you can replace the cap. Hold the twist haler upright and twist the cap to the right in a clockwise direction until you hear a click. Store your twist haler in a place that's dry and that stays at a comfortable temperature. A kitchen cabinet might be a good spot. It won't get too hot or too cold, and it stays dry, and it's up and away from children and pets. When you follow the steps we've shown you today, the twist haler will do exactly what it's supposed to do, deliver the right amount of medicine every time, and help you breathe easier.